Welcome to the replay. We're in the city park, the uh, New Orleans. Look at this beautiful sculpture garden here. Hey, Hal. So just walking through uh, City Park. They have this beautiful sculpture garden. So I thought I'd just quickly show a few of the sculptures. Hey, Judy. You been to this place, Judy? Sculpture Garden, City Park, New Orleans? Yeah, hi. It's kind of cool. Oh, you haven't? Oh, I'm going to show you some of the my favorites. Frazier for life, hello. So it's in a beautiful setting in um, City Park here in New Orleans, among the trees with the Spanish moss. Got the, the beads, the Mardi Gras hanging in the trees. It's all the uh, 20th century. Yeah, it looks like Savannah, doesn't it? We're headed to Savannah, by the way. Oh, I told you that. So way down there, they got, if you can see, they got the blue dog down there, which you see at every little tourist shop around the dub sign. Yeah, it does kind of look, look like Savannah. It's a really beautiful day. It's uh, low 20s. It's cloudy, but it's not supposed to rain until this afternoon, so we got lucky. The storms are now not coming in until Friday, so we're lucky for us. So this beautiful setting. Yeah, it's real calm too, so it's nice. Hey, by the way, I, I did a playback of what I did yesterday, and, and my voice was really quiet. Is people, uh, am I talking loud enough? This is a Brotrero, if you've ever seen this guy. I've seen some of this artwork before. Oh, good, thank you. I thought maybe I was getting kind of meek or something with my projection. Look at the reflection in the water. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much for letting me know that. Hey, anybody know uh, who lives in the South, maybe this uh, Spanish moss, if it is Spanish moss, because that's what we call it. And somebody told me don't touch it because it's got chiggers which really are nasty, they get under your skin. This is uh, by Sandro Chia. It's a figure with a tear and an arrow. She, poor thing's got an arrow in her back. Judy, you're so nice. The broadcast voice, it's nice. I like this piece here. Called Heroic Man. It's by Lache, British born in France, made in 1930. Got a small head though. No, I heard about it when we walked in, but it's in the evening. I'm not sure we're going to get down here in the evening. We're, we're going to go to a jazz club, the Three Muses over in the Frenchman uh, Street for dinner and swing jazz. Maybe I can scope that tonight. Yeah, you got to go. You just take the uh, Canal Street uh, streetcar and go all the way to the end. It comes down to City Park. Oh, Judy, you know that? Yeah, we're looking forward to that. We got reservations, but not till nine because there's four of us. It's a very small club, so it's the earliest we could get. You put up with me. I'm going to go to my favorite uh, sculpture piece in the whole place. But we'll see a couple things more. This is called Acme, 1990. Yeah, it's not hot. There's no hardly, there's no humidity. It's really nice. I like this piece too. Poor guy's hanging forever. Excuse me. 
by Allison Saar. Kind of got a Chinese look to it, but it's an American artist. Yeah, that's what I heard. All the locals say it's a good time of the year to come. So that's why we're here. Isn't that nice? The water's so calm. So this is by uh, Armand Pierre Fernandez, 1983. Pablo Casal's Obelisk, it's called. Yeah, I like that one, too. Yeah, they were saying August is the worst. Really? I'm going to show you my favorite piece, and then I'm going to... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I just forgot one piece. Thank you, Judy. I like this. Let's see if I get the whole thing in. It's like it's hanging in midair. It's by Ehrlich from Argentina. It's Windows with Ladder. Too Late for Help, 2006. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. So, there's a couple people around my favorite piece. But Go across this bridge, and then I'll turn around. These people are... Here we go. That's a beautiful park. Look at this. I love this. This is by Doho Su, Korean. Uh, 2012. It's called Karma. Yeah, it's a modern totem. Brushed um, metal. These guys are all stacked up and they all got me covering each other's eyes. These people are waiting on me, so I gotta go. <laughs> yeah, it's a beautiful little park here. City park. And they have a botanical gardens, we're headed over there. They have a, a museum of art, we'll probably go there. You take the streetcar down here, the, the red car. I'll do that, Judy, I'll say hello. Yeah, how are we scoping here, people? We're scoping here, people. Come on. We're from uh, San Francisco, Bay Area. So we're out here in New Orleans. We met our friends from Melbourne, or Melbourne, Australia. Uh, and Judy, he's coming up to Yale, up to New Haven, to do a talk. He's a constitutional law professor. And so we met him here, and we're doing New Orleans, we're doing Savannah, we're doing, yeah, we do a lot of traveling. We're pre-grandkids, uh, so we're trying to squeeze in as much as we can. I'll have to find out, but it's probably in two weeks, because we're going to be here for two weeks, so, in the south. So, well, I'll, I'll show you one more piece. That's, this is the Museum of Art here. Hey, Ecuador. Hola, Ecuador. Como esta? Yeah, you're welcome. I always try to do, I'm, I'm always, uh, when we travel, I was the kind of the, the educational PBS of scoping. I always try to do something educational. I like this piece too. This is uh, Chadwick, 1979. Yeah, springtime in April. Isn't that nice? I'll show you. I said that was going to be the last one, but there's just so much beautiful art here. I like this piece. This is uh, Renoir. You, you guys might have heard of him. Venus Victorious, 1914, in bronze. Yeah, isn't that nice? And this is this is the front gate. Yeah, you're welcome, and I'm, I'm going to go because this is, uh, gets too long. So, I find something interesting, I'll scope again. So we're, we're here until Saturday, and then Savannah, and then Charleston, and in mid... Yeah, you're welcome, Al. And in mid-April, we're heading to Spain for seven weeks, so uh, I'll do some scopes there, probably. I'm trying to work up a following again. I, I had a lot when we did our Southwest trip and lost some. We got some more our Northern European trip. 
now I'm trying to build it up again because that's just the way it is because I can't scope where I live every day it would get boring <laughs> I do some scopes at home but uh, uh, yeah it would get a little boring alright well thanks for watching and uh, we'll catch you guys next time thanks see ya